Neurological and psychiatric disorders are particularly challenging because of the way we diagnose them and that the disease entities, as we call them, are very heterogeneous and don't reflect often underlying biology. So the biology may cut across diagnoses. There's really not, if you get a diagnosis of schizophrenia, it's really clear that that's a cluster of pathophysiologies. It's multiple features of a disease that lumps into a diagnostic category. That's been the challenge for neuroscience, uh, maybe more than most, uh, most therapeutic areas. So where we're making advance is breaking that down. It's not just depression or it's not just schizophrenia. It's not even just Alzheimer's disease, but it's features of the disease that you can attach to a specific biology toward which you can make a specific medicine that, that impacts that feature of disease.